Aloha, of course, literally translates into hello and goodbye and love, right? But aloha is a very powerful word that speaks to a love and love that love that you you have or you share or reciprocate it isn't um, a sexual love it's an intimate a very deep profound love that you have for yourself that you have for others and you have for the earth when you feel that that actually is meant to compel but the unfortunate thing too is that people who don't truly understand the Aloha spirit is that they just expect it's one-sided. The entitlements they believe they should get should be given because that's Aloha. Not understanding that Aloha is also something you give to. It's not just what you get. But when you have Aloha, things like rage, jealousy, bitterness, and anger, that stuff melts away. And I think that application is actually universal. So if you, wherever you are, and whatever you do, if you can go and, um, and when you're done, that um, you leave the place the same or better, then you've done it with Aloha, right? I think, and that's unfortunate too, because it's not just a visitor issue, it's a human issue, where our beaches become dirty our um, our um, organizations, our establishments, um, people who work there are mistreated. That when you can go and um, you've been kind. The, the thing that I would hope is that um, in your own human interactions that you get a chance to spread that. Mm -hmm.